Murrieta Mesa stuns the Desert Sky League champions Granite Hills, eliminating the Lady Cougars with a 33-31 opening round win in the CIF Division 3A playoffs. Mesa enters the postseason ranked 20th in 3A, the fourth place team in the Southwestern League. Mesa steals the inbounds pass, Alexis Williams up court to freshman Kesslin Henson, and the visitors lead 4-2. to two. Granite Hills, 6-3 junior, Brilani Bell ties it at 4. Jasanya Burleson intercepts and takes it all the way, and Marietta Mesa leads 9-4 at the end of the first quarter. 11-6 when Kesslin Henson hits from out. Freshman Kaylee Klemp pulls down the defensive rebound, heads up court, and sends the assist to Danielle Hutchinson, whose basket gives Mesa a seven-point lead, 13 to six. Rilani Bell scores on the reverse layup to pull Granite Hills within three, 13-10 when Mesa defender Sage Estrada is called for a blocking foul. You see the reaction to the call from Murrieta fans. Brilani Bell hits the offensive board and puts it in, and the Lady Cougars have tied the score at 13. Alexis Williams wrestles it away and takes it to the hoop, and Mesa regains the lead 15-13. A pair of Anisha Gibbs free throws ties the score, and Anisha Gibbs steals the ball and has the breakaway, but it does not go. The teams go to the locker rooms at halftime, deadlocked at 15. 6-foot senior Emily Stallo blocks the shot and Kesslin Henson takes it all the way to give Mesa a 20-16 lead three minutes into the second half. Brilani Bell scores to pull the Lady Cougars within 2-20-18. Mesa's tenacious defense again pays dividends when Kesslin Henson makes the steal and scores on the breakaway. 22-18, Murrieta. Kesslin Henson runs down the long rebound and takes it down, knocks it in off the glass, and the Mesa lead is 6-24-18. The visitors are up by 4-24-20 to begin the fourth quarter. Anisha Gibbs' first field goal of the second half comes one minute into the fourth quarter. Granite Hills is back within two, 24 to 22. A pair of Anisha Gibbs free throws ties the score at 24, with six minutes showing on the fourth quarter clock. Anisha Gibbs drives and scores with the left hand, and Granite Hills retakes the lead, 26-24. Five minutes remain. Mesa goes back on top on the Sage Estrada basket. 27-26, 4.46 on the clock. Teslin Hansen from just inside the arc, 29-26. Another clutch shot from long range. Alexis Williams nails the three and puts Mesa up by six, 32-26 with just under three minutes to play. Anisha Gibbs' lone three-pointer of her final game brings Granite Hills within three, 32-29. Brilani Bell's putback has the Lady Cougars within two with 15 seconds remaining. Marietta Mesa holds on and escapes Apple Valley with the 33-31 upset victory. I-15 Auctions, sold on supporting high school sports. I-15 Auctions, everything from estate auctions to high-quality, low-priced vehicles.